Hi guys with our new breakdown video. Since the working principles of all brand and model devices are the same, the solutions are very easy. I am waiting for your questions about all brands from the comments. In this video, I will show you the simple troubleshooting solution for devices not charging, not turning on, constantly interrupted while charging, and slow charging. Of course, what you need to do first is to check your charger and cable. But if you are sure about these parts, there may be a problem with the charging socket of our device. Let's see how we can solve this for free. The brand of our device can be Samsung, Lenovo, Apple, Mi, Honor, HP, Huawei, Reader or other brands and replica products. This is a valid repair for all. I am waiting for all your questions in the next repair process. I will answer you quickly and offer you the most suitable repair cost. As a very simple process, you can easily solve your problem by following what I did step by step. Unfortunately, many repairmen do not share this information with you. Since our videos are step by step troubleshooting videos, I will add my other step by step method videos to the explanation and to the end of the video, you should also apply them. When we move our device a little while it is charging or change the direction of the cable, we see that the charging process does not continue properly. Our aim is to solve this problem. These malfunctions can usually be caused by oxidation that may occur in our charging socket and charging cable. As you can see this malfunction, we will use a contact cleaner lubricant of the WD-40 or equivalent 404 brand that I use. Our devices may sometimes lock, may not turn on, may not charge. In this case, the solution may be very simple. Our device is currently charging with the value of 5 volts and 3 amps that appears on our meter. 3 amps is really a very low number. After the repair process, let's see how many amperes of electricity our device will start to draw. By following the steps I did in my video, we can fix your faulty device in a short time and solve your problems by going step by step. Again, we will repair a device without the cost of parts. The fault solution is almost the same in devices with this and the same working principle, it is useful to follow the same methods. You can write your problems about all other devices you want to get information from in the comments. Our expert staff is waiting for you to answer your questions. All of our expert staff are waiting for your questions about your tablet phone, computer and all your electronic devices and are looking forward to answering them. First of all, we should have WD-40 or 404 or a contact cleaner and lubricant you trust in this repair process. We used this spray when repairing the mouse keys and scroll wheel. And it was a very easy fix. We squeeze a small amount of our contact cleaner into the charging socket and by plugging and unplugging the charging cable a few times, we make this oxidation more effective through friction. I am trying this with you right now. Friends, this video is the first stage repair video. This video will repair our device with 20% probability. Friends, at the end of our video, you will see what a great job we have done. While making repairs, it is necessary to give great importance to the cosmetic appearance. If this is not the solution, I am waiting for your brand and model information in the comments for my other step suggestions. Our expert team will answer your questions in a few minutes. We connect our cable and try again. Let's see how the result will be. We will try with different 5 volt outputs, but our amperage value will vary we see that the repair we made was successful. It is a simple repair that we can do at home. You can recommend it to everyone. The device receives 8 amps of electricity. 
This is approximately three times the amount before the repair. We found the defective part of our device. If the fault is not resolved by cleaning, this part will have to be replaced. We clean the oxidation by dripping WD-40, contact cleaner, or disinfectant as I applied. I recommend you to subscribe and browse our other useful videos. I would be very happy if you recommend my channel to your friends. Even though we moved the cable, there was no interruption in the device charging. We saw how successful our process was. You can also apply the same process to your devices. By removing oxidation with WD-40 or 404 lubricant contact cleaner, the charge of our device becomes more stable and I have experienced this many times and wanted to share it with you. If you want to increase the life of the device by 10 years with a low budget, you should apply this video. You should also see the positive comments in our other videos. In all of our repair processes, we repaired our device very easily and cost-free, and you can fix your faults by following the steps I have done. Our devices may sometimes lock, may not turn on, may not charge. In this case, the solution may be very simple. Friends who did not get results from this video, I will add the second stage video link to the explanation section. If you apply our second stage video, it will repair your device with a 30% probability. And the result is a very happy development. You should definitely try it. We got very good feedback in our previous videos. Write your result in the comments and we will reply. Even though we moved the cable, there was no interruption in the device charging. We saw how successful our process was. You can also apply the same process to your devices. Thank you for watching our video. Don't forget to like and subscribe and share our video with your friends that you want to benefit from. If you write your questions and opinions in the comments, your other brand model printer computer scanner problems, I will reply as soon as possible for the solution. Thanks.